Hi there, this is Jesse with Wade Up Fly Fishing. Stay tuned with us as we go on to do a little fly fishing in Boise, Idaho on the Boise River, Idaho's urban fishery gem. We're going to hopefully get into some rainbows, maybe some browns, but we'll probably just catch a whole bunch of white fish. So stay tuned, don't do any of those iPhone gestures, and we'll be right back with you with some more fly fishing. Okay, looks like we're here doing a little winter fishing with the fly rod on the Boise River in town. And it's kind of tough with these subtle strikes of these fish. So far, I've just caught the white fish. But the temperature outside was about 30, 33 degrees when I got into the water, so it's pretty cold. But I've got a nice little spot here for some fish to hang out in this seam. There's uh, one of many spots along the river here in town like this. Just lots of rainbows, browns. But you got that native white fish that inhabits the area. So we'll just see if we can't get in some more of these fish. During the winter months, I like to use the Euro rig. The Euro nymph is a little bit more effective than your traditional American nymphing, at least I've found, because you know, by the time you get a fish to strike that fly, the indicator kind of lags behind and you miss a lot of those real subtle takes. working over lots of water trying to figure out where these fish are hanging out I like this uh, about three foot deep water kind of slow kind of easy going it's a pretty popular spot here there are some other secluded spots, but they stock this river pretty regularly different times of the year with uh, rainbows out of that Nanfa hatchery. But the winter months are a little harder pressed to come by the rainbows. Of course, there's also a lot of bank fishing to be done. People like to come down here and throw out worms, uh, spinners, salmon eggs, you know, all kinds of different things. Then during fall, I'll have a couple times where they'll put in some steelhead that they caught down at the Hell's Canyon Dam. You look up and down the river and you'll see one fisherman after another is that battle fishing. I kind of like this more secluded fishing here, but a lot of different access points along the river. A lot of people come down here. So it's always nice to have like a plan B or maybe even a plan C. Unless you want to be stomping through, you know, water's already been fished and kind of get the sloppy seconds. You know, it's uh, right now it's about uh, 11.30, maybe 12 o'clock, and we could already be fishing sloppy seconds, you know. It's been kind of slow. Only got the one white fish so far, but we've kind of been working some of this water here. See what we can get our mitts on here. But you know, we're working 
the water here. We've got uh, got the squirmy wormy. Some of them seem to like that. And then we've got my own creation here. This is the it's all wrapped up here on the line, but uh, this is the tungsten flash mob nymph does pretty good kind of to me it kind of looks maybe like an egg with a you know like a little uh, fry coming out of it you know there's lots of hatch a lot of uh spawning going on around here with these different fish we got squirmy wormy a lot you know lots of worms around here so you know it could be pretty productive you know just gotta throw a lot of different things out here and see what these fish are after stuck here see if we can untangle this flies a little bit I kind of do like using this snake tongue uh, to fly set up here it's pretty easy as opposed to doing the you know second nymph tied onto the first nymphs hook bend because a lot of those uh, heavy euro flies you get over at the fly shops that are tied on barbless hooks and you get the barbless hooks with the hook another fly tied on the hook bend that you'll lose that other fly because it will just you know flop right off of there flying through the air but uh well fellow anglers we sure hope you enjoyed our first video today as we just launched our new YouTube channel, Wait Up Fly Fishing. We'll be bringing more content here up soon on bringing out your inner angler so we can have a good time fly fishing as we hook up some nice browns and rainbows and white fish here in Boise, Idaho. Stay tuned and we hope to see you on the river soon.